och välkomna till The Scoop. I denne uge kunne vi jo lade sig ikke optræde i showet, for Ludmilla havde lagt en fælde for hende og byttet sig det endnu. Og efter at doktoren sagde, at det ville lade at hun faktisk er helt ok og kan synge igen, har hendes mor bestemt sig for at hun aldrig vil lade hende synge igen. Violetta lavede Jumix showen, og Ludmilla er nu redo at hans plads. Og Diego spurgte Violetta, om hun virkelig elsker ham. Har I lyst til noget rigtig lækkert? For jeg har nemlig en overraskelse til jer. Jeg snakkede med Angie fra Violetta tidligere, og hun fortalte mig, at hun er midt i at planlægge en fest for Broadway. Han kan rigtig godt lide frugt, fordi det giver ham energi til at danse og optræde. Så hun synes, det ville være en rigtig god idé at lave en lækker frugtsmoothie til ham. Jeg bad hende om at vise os, hvordan hun gør. Så bare se her. So I had this great idea to make a delicious but healthy treat smoothie for Broadway. And I've got together all his favorite fruits. There's uh, strawberries, blueberries, some cashews, basil leaves, kiwi, white grapes and pumpkin or squash. This is pretty squishy already, but if yours isn't, you can just boil it for a while and let it cool. Ask an adult for help with that. Squash is actually really good in a smoothie and mango. All right then, let's take a picture. Mm, wait. Mm, I love grapes. Mm. All right, here we go. Mm -hmm. Okay, let's see what the recipe says so I don't miss any steps. First, I need a container I can blend in. Then I have to cut the squash. We've already done that. And then the mango and blend them with a little orange juice. Perfect. So, let's see. I'm going to put some of the squash here. Cut the mango and scoop out the flesh. Ask an adult to help with this. Now we need some orange juice. Just squeeze out half an orange. Okay, perfect. Ask an adult to help you blend it. Okay, now I have the first layer and uh, for the second now I need to blend the, the basil. This is it, looks great. And then uh, the grapes and kiwi then. That's all the green stuff. That's the second layer, so the, the third layer, that's just strawberries. It's looking really colorful already. I'll take the blueberries. And then some cashew nuts. Oh, and a little water. There. I'll spoon this layer as it's heavier than the strawberries. So, there it is. That's my super smoothie. Well, it's looking pretty good, but I think Broadway would really like it if I decorate it. Um, mango. I'm using a cookie cutter to make a flower. And kiwi. And I'll put them on a skewer with a strawberry. Amazing! That really finishes it off. I think Broadway's really gonna like this. Oh, I really like that. Fantastic! And maybe just one more thing. Yes, yes, yes. Some blueberries, yeah. I'll pop them on the top. I wonder how many I can... Oh, yeah, I can fit a few more in. Okay, let's take another picture. I'm really happy with the way this turned out. And then the straw. Mm, let's have a taste. Mmm. Mmm. It's fantastic. Mmm. Mm. 
tastes really fruity. You can really taste all the flavors I mixed in. I think Broadway is going to like it and it's, it's going to remind him of his country. Clara, why don't you try and make one, maybe with flavors from your country? I think it would be a great idea for all of you at home to try and come up with your own smoothie. Bye for now. See ya. Mmm, den er virkelig god. Tak for tipet, Angie. Nu er det din tur til at prøve. Hvis du har brug for opskriften, kan du finde den online på vores blog. Næste uge, Lara vil tvinge Lea om til at tage et vigtigt valg. Vil han valge hun eller Violetta? Kommer Violetta optræde igen? Og hennes Jumix jobb över. Okej, okay, Francesca Svinna, man finner en måde att behålla henne på en och på. Tack för att du såg på. Och vi ses i nästa vecka. För då ska vi ha en morsom violetta test. Hej!